everyone, it's Blakely with Cooking for Bimbos, and I'm here today to show you an amazing turkey burger recipe. I'm going to do a Greek-inspired turkey burger. We're going to make homemade tzatziki sauce for the top, and it's so good, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. So in our bowl, we have about a pound and a quarter of ground turkey. I'm going to add some red pepper right in here. I'm going to add some chopped red onion. Make sure you chop it pretty fine. Don't want big chunks of onion in there. There you go, some chopped red onion in there. I have some sun-dried tomatoes that I chopped up we're gonna put in here. I'm going to, I have some frozen spinach. Now, normally I like to use fresh spinach if you ever watch any of my videos, but this time it's really important to use the frozen spinach. You're gonna wanna let it thaw completely and then you're gonna wanna squeeze every ounce of juice out of it. You really wanna get all that water out. You don't want kind of wet turkey burgers. So I'm just giving a quick chop, even though it's chopped spinach. I'm just gonna chop it up, just like this. Perfect, I'm gonna put this right in here. I also have some chopped fresh oregano right in here. If you don't have fresh, you can use dried in this, that's okay. I'm gonna do some salt, you wanna season them up. We have some pepper. I have some feta cheese I'm gonna put in here. Look at that. And then, we, just to ensure that it really binds nicely when we, when we cook it on our griddle pan, we're gonna add an egg in here. We're also gonna add just a little bit of breadcrumbs, like a fourth of a cup. Just a little bit in here. You don't want them like meatloafs, but you just wanna make sure that they stay together. So going in with our clean hands, kind of break up that yolk. Give it a good mix all together. We're gonna form them into patties then. And I'm gonna put them on a bun with some nice red onion or tzatziki, some crisp lettuce. It's gonna be awesome. All the flavor, all the flavors of grease in a burger. All right, perfect. So make sure it. Everything looks incorporated. You, want, you don't want one to have more than the other. All right, so now I'm gonna make nice sized burgers here. Kind of pat it together. Just mix it around your hand. Pat them, um, just like that. Beautiful, perfect. I'm gonna pat all of our burgers up. So look at how great these look. They look very flavorful, very fresh. So I'm gonna add it on our grill pan here that I have kind of preheating. Put them right on here. And then while these are cooking, I'm gonna make some homemade tzatziki sauce. Perfect. Yay! Okay, so we're gonna set this aside and go wash our hands. So in my bowl, I have just some plain Greek yogurt. Make sure it's not vanilla or anything. Double check that it. it's just straight plain. Perfect, now into there. When we were in Greece, they used to actually sit here and grate their cucumber, which I loved because it made a really cool texture, but if you just want to dice it, you can. Not a problem. So you're gonna grate this in here, just like this. Perfect, put all that in there. We need to add more, we can. But I'm also gonna grate in some garlic. I like mine a little garlicky, because I love garlic. So I'm doing about two small cloves, or one big one. Okay, get all this off. Look good this looks already. Do a little bit of lemon zest in here. And then we're gonna do the lemon juice in here. Lots of lemon juice. Mm. These burgers smell so good. Give it a quick little stir, look at that. Yes, looks so good. Can add a good amount of salt. Gonna add some pepper. And we're gonna add some fresh dill. Very important you use fresh. Chop. Chop it all up. Perfect. Look at that. 
Voila, homemade tzatziki sauce. Yum. Take a look at our burgers and see how they're doing in here. Oh yeah, I think it's time to flip. Woo. Yum. Look at that. Yes. Now, if you don't have a griddle pan, you can do it on a skillet. That's not a big deal. Put them all up here. Perfect. And let them cook on the other side and assemble our turkey burgers. Go. So look how amazing they look. I'm so excited. So I just put some buns on here to kind of toast them up because I love some toasty buns. I'm going to turn this off just like that. Take these off. You want to make sure they're completely cooked through. It only took about four minutes per side. Take them off here. Perfect. Look at those. You can see the spinach, the red pepper, the red onion. That feta is starting to melt a little bit. So let's assemble one. So excited. So I have my beautifully toasted bun here. Right on here. Alright, to that, we're gonna do a few things. I'm gonna add some, I like to add, just add some nice lettuce. Do a big chunk of red onion because I love a huge red onion on mine. That's just me. I'm gonna do some tomato and then our tzatziki sauce. Look at that. Oh. Yes. Now, if this doesn't make you hungry, then I don't know what will. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Go ahead and add our bun right back on here. Give it a good push. Yes. Time to eat. And there you have my insanely delicious Greek turkey burgers. I hope you like it. Mmm. <laughs> mm. oh, so good.